Hi guys, this is Liz Kaneda from Sleekwens. Today I'm going to show you a short tutorial on how to fix and correct skin tone and blemishes. And we're going to be doing that by using the Strike a Pose workflow. So two of the most common problems you'll find is either red skin or green skin. So right now I'm going to start with a red skin and show you how to correct that. So I have this photograph right here of this little girl and as you can see it does kind of have a little bit of a red tint to it. So there are two ways you can do this with the Strike a Pose workflow and the first way is by using an all-in-one preset. I'm sorry, not an all-in-one preset. You could use a preset to apply to the entire photograph. So what you're going to do is you're going to scroll and we have color correct presets right here and all you have to do is click the fix red skin. And as you can see it's taken a bunch of red out of the picture. So basically what you're doing when you hit the color correct fix red skin is you're applying a preset that has a kind of green undertone because green and red are opposite each other on the color wheel and that's why they cancel each other out. So before we had this kind of red tint, all we did was hit the preset and it's gone. All right, so I'm gonna go back and I'm gonna show you a second way to do this. So say your entire photograph isn't red, but a specific area is maybe just on the cheeks or the forehead. What we're going to do is we're going to use our brushes. So we're going to go to our brushes. And I'm going to go down to my Strike a Pose brushes. And we have the Strike a Pose color brushes. And we have one here that says Fix Red Skin. Alright, so now that I have that highlighted, as you can see, if I click on the color down here, we have this kind of mint green color, which is going to cancel out the red. So, for instance, if I wanted to keep the red tint in the background, but I didn't want her skin to be red, the brush would kind of come in handy for this. Alright, so if I put my cursor over here, you can see everywhere that I've highlighted with the brush. What I'm going to do is I'm going to adjust this brush a little bit by pulling up the exposure and turning the saturation up a little bit. And then I don't think that I pulled out enough red, so I'm going to hit new and I'm going to use the same exact brush over again in a few areas. I don't want to use the brush too much because then her skin will actually turn green and that is a problem. And again I'm going to adjust the brush. All right, so here's the before and the after. So we've taken some of the red out and we've added a little bit of light to her skin. But we've also kept the red tint in the background. So that's one way to correct red skin. Now I'm gonna show you a way to correct green skin. So I have this photograph right here and as you can see, it really does have a green tint all over to it. So like we had with the first photograph, you can do the same thing with the presets. You can go to your color correct and you can hit fix green skin. And what that's doing basically is the same thing. It's applying a red tint to the photograph so that that cancels out the green. So here's the before and the after. You can see there's a difference there. And even if you decide you hit the color correct fix green skin preset and you don't think it's enough that you know you haven't taken out enough of the green, what you can do is you can go to your colors tab and adjust the preset by going to saturation and lowering the green a little bit. Or even going to the hue and changing the hue of the green.
Okay, so here's the before and the after. All right, so the second way to do this, I'm gonna reset the photograph, is by using the brush. So you're gonna to go to your Strike a Pose Fix Green Skin Brush. And we're gonna do the same thing we did earlier and just run this brush all over. And I'm gonna run the brush in her hair as well because even though that's not her skin, it's kind of got this weird green look to it. Now the brushes aren't as strong when it comes to fixing the skin as the presets are, but then again, you don't want the preset if you're trying to only do a specific area like her face. So what I can do is I can actually change the color as well a little bit and move it up so it's a little bit darker. And then I can turn the saturation up a little bit and the exposure as well. All right, so I'm going to zoom into her face. So here's the before and the after. It has made quite a difference. You can see she's kind of got that green skin and now we've just kind of neutralized it. And again, even if you've used the brush, you can basically use your navigator over here to change the whole photograph. So you could also go into your colors, your saturation, and turn the green down a little bit. Maybe turn the yellow down a little bit as well. And then hue, you can use the hue to change the shade of the green. All right, here's the before and the after, which is much more balanced. So we've gone over how to fix red skin and how to fix green skin. The last thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna show you how to remove blemishes. This third photograph here, and I'm just gonna zoom into her face because it's all we're really gonna work on right now. And as you can see, she's got some blemishes on her face. So the best way to get rid of this is by using the spot removal tool. So you're gonna click right here and you can adjust the size of the spot removal tool this way or you can use your bracket keys on your computer. And you're just gonna click over the dot and what it's gonna do is pull up another replacement. So you're gonna to wanna to pick an area that's close by but also doesn't have a blemish in it. And you're just gonna do that until they are all gone. A lot of times what you'll find with people who have acne or blemishes is that they have an uneven skin tone. So we have a brush for that as well. Let me just get all the blemishes out first. Got one more right down here. All right, so we've gotten rid of all her blemishes. Here's the before, after. We've cleared up her skin a little bit. So I'm gonna go to my brushes now and back down to my Strike a Pose brushes. And we're gonna go to the face even skin tone. And I'm just gonna run my brush gently over her face. and turn the exposure up a little bit. And I'm gonna hit new, and I'm gonna just do that one more time. All right, so here's the before and the after. So we evened out the skin tone and we've gotten rid of the blemishes. And another thing you will find with people who have blemishes or acne, um, they often have redder skin. And she has a little bit of red skin around her nose and on her eyelids and on her cheeks, but this is probably more like a blush or a flush. So you could just leave that. 
but we're going to go to our brushes and we're going to use the fix green skin. I'm sorry, fix red skin. Okay, and then I'm going to make the brush a little bit smaller and I'm just going to run it over the areas where it's already kind of red. Let me turn the saturation down a little bit and the exposure up. I'm going to hit new and I'm going to do it once more over the red part of her nose. All right, so here's the before and the after. So we've evened out her skin tone, added light to her face, and gotten rid of the blemishes. So that's how you can use the Strike a Pose workflow to fix skin tone and blemishes. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial and you'll be able to try it for yourself soon.